Well, what else can you say about Jose Aldo Jr.? Strong ground game, knockout power is there, some of the best leg kicks in UFC history. Representing Nova Uniao, Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, still the man considered by many to be the greatest featherweight in the history of mixed martial arts. Jose Aldo has devastating Muay Thai techniques, and to go along with that, he has a world-class ground game. We very rarely see that ground game, though, because his striking is so incredibly effective. Yes, here he is, the founder of Jeet Kune Do, and as Dana White calls him, the father of modern mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee making the walk tonight. You can make the argument no man has had as much of an influence on UFC fighters as Bruce Lee has. Quoted as saying, the best fighter is someone who can adapt to any style. Man, it would have been great to see what Bruce Lee could have done inside the UFC. He is making the walk tonight. This guy is amongst one of the most elusive fighters as far as his defense is concerned. Extremely difficult to hit. And now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Both fighters are 31. And they both possess the same height and a similar reach. All right, now with the official introductions, we go inside the octagon of Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Mario Yamasaki. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon! All right, I gave instructions to you guys in the locker room. I want you guys to follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Touch gloves. Good luck. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in because it's about to go down right now. All right, here we go. All right, here's Bruce Lee getting ready for another UFC start as we begin round one. So fast, so quick, so good at setting up striking angles, and it's hard to simulate the speed in training. I know the opponent has talked a lot about trying to find training partners to simulate Bruce Lee. Easier said than done. Bruce Lee trying to get off to a good start tonight. Joe, how does he approach this particular challenge tonight? Jose Aldo is a great striker, and his knee techniques are amongst the best in the business. Oh, nice jab to the head by Aldo. Both guys have proved to be dangerous in the opening seconds of this fight. Nice jab. Lee gets absolutely punished by that head kick. Joey missed with that straight right attempt. Lee gets caught by the inside leg kick. Trying to find a home for that right hand. Oh, he got cracked with the jab there, Joe. And his head is firmly on the center line, the one place it really can't afford to be. He's showing some vulnerability here by leaning right into his opponent's range. Let's see if he can make some adjustments here. 
Nice inside leg kick there. Good leg kick. Lance with a right hand. Head kick attempt. That'll work. Well, he misses with the left punch there. That kick from the southpaw position. He loves that left to the body. Oh! Just missed with the left there. He's keeping his head protected here. Excellent blocking. Oh, right hand is there for him, Joe. Establishing the jab here. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Lee. Nice job moving off the center line. He slips to avoid that right hand. Switching stances here. Right on the button. Nice right hook. Beautiful leg kick. Aldo caught him with the left hand there. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Oh, head kick. Nice defense there, huge block. Oh, big kick! The left hook hits home. Missed the mark. Oh, man, with that right leg kick. Nice inside leg kick, not even telegraph. All right, we have now reached the final minute of round one. Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. 45 seconds to go here in round one. Another vicious liver kick. Effective punch there by Aldo. It's a high one. 30 seconds now to go in the opening round. Oh, how clean is that jab by Aldo? Lands to the body. Oh, how technical is that? Nice straight punch. Look at that, he's timing that jab. Oh, nice defense there, Joe, to block that shot. Head kick. Nice shot. Second oh, round, straight up. Go, go, go. And here's a nice kick to the body that lands. And here's another kick to the body. And here's one more perfectly placed kick to the body. Very impressive striking going on in that round. That was beautiful. Brilliant. Great counterfight. Couldn't have asked any more for you. I want more of this. The beautiful Brittany Palmer with us. Here you go, second round. You ready? You ready? Let's round go. two here. All right, so here we go with round two. Good first round in the books. Both fighters had their moment. Again, I'm glad I'm not a judge, right? A difficult round to score. We will see, though, Joe, if there's an uptick in the aggression here in round two. Jose Aldo is one of the most explosive and dynamic fighters to ever fight in MMA. The former soccer star has tremendous leg kicks as well as a world-class Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu ground game. 
Lee gets caught by the inside leg. He got lit up. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. Lee gets stung by that leg kick. Hard hook. Oh, and he lands yet another strike to the body. Pinpoint placement right underneath the elbow. Look how light he is on his feet, too. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Well, he's landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward, combinations. Throw your punches in bunches and really try to force the issue and get your opponent out of there. Hit him with the jab. Aldo's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Well, his opponent's got the read now, Joe, as he lands the punch to the head. He's got to change up his striking pattern and the tempo, or he's going to continue to be vulnerable to that count. He goes upstairs with the kick. Whiffs on the straight right hand. He's got good accuracy on that jab. Yeah, missed on that one, Joe. Oh. Well, a really good second round for him thus far after a somewhat lackluster first round. He has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. Just misses with the straight left hand. Clean head kick lands. Nice punch there by Lee. Oh, slips the punch there, Joe. And he eats a kick. Aldo gets hit by that kick to the body. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Head off the center line, slips the punch. Oh, Superman punch. Not always easy to execute. He did so there. Aldo gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. seconds to go now. Watch the shot here, Joe. Just a slip there. Really swung for the fences with that hook, but misses. And again, Joe, he's showing a vulnerability to that jab, leaning right into his opponent's striking range and leaving his head wide open to absorb damage. Let's see if he can make some adjustments here. Oh, a huge block there. Good inside leg kick. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand, just out of range. Misses again with a right punch. Aldo shot is blocked. Caught him with a punch. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course. Oh, jumping knee! Ten seconds to go here. Let's see what happens. That one hurt. Back and forth we go. And there's a nice head kick that lands. And here's another head kick.
And here's one more perfectly placed head kick. Really excellent striking being displayed in that round. Ariane Celeste in the building. Third round underway. All right, next round is underway. You know these are two of the more conditioned fighters on the roster, so cardio is not going to be an issue here. And for some fighters, you know, you can have one of those adrenaline dumps or the cardio abandons you on fight night. But not the case for these two guys. Both look very fresh as we start this next round. Able to land with the left hand there. Ooh, blocks the shot. Head kick. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. Jose Aldo with a vicious leg kick. Missed with that attempt. We show you the total strikes. Going to the kick here, Joe. Well, that kick landed the body beautifully placed right underneath that elbow. Let's see if he makes the adjustments now defensively to avoid opening up that midsection to further damage by that kick. Well, the right hand has been there at times, not that time. Tags him. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. Working well off of that jab, Joe. They are trading huge punches here. Oh, he lands a massive kick here. Look how light he is on his feet, too. Beautifully timed and placed kick there by Lee. Three minutes remain in the round. Well, not sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been far more aggressive, a lot more pressure. Oh, he's really starting to light him up now. Oh! Just reached the midway point of the fight. Oh, and he ate a front kick. Well, looks as though his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Check that one. He comes forward with a flying knee that just missed hitting the target flush. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Aldo gets tagged by that kick. That can't feel real good, Joe. Look at that nasty jab. Oh, huge block. Trying to establish that jab once again. And able to avoid the punch there. Nice slip by Lee. That's a really strong leg kick there by Aldo. Head kick is blocked. Slips the punch. Tries a big hook to the head, but misses. Wow! Side leg kick is there. All right, so another strike to the body there. And Joe, we've seen in the later stages of this fight, not only an uptick in the aggression, but also in the body work. Didn't see a lot of that from him in the earlier rounds. Beautiful, clean, accurate jab for Jose Aldo. Another shot lands upstairs. Oh, 
Nice slip there to avoid the punch by Lee. Oh, that is as good a jab as you will see. Aldo continues to throw a very high volume of strikes. Lee gets touched by that jab. That was a stiff one too, Joe. And both guys really throwing with authority. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. And that'll do it, 15 minutes in the books. And there's a nice head kick that lands. And here's another head kick. And here's one more perfectly placed head kick. Incredible striking on display in that round. Ariane Celeste is holding it down. Joe Rogan, pretty good round for both guys the last time out. Now we'll see if one fighter or another can really take control of this fight. Both fighters have been aggressive, but also defensive. We'll see how they approach this next round and try to really put this fight in their favor. Fainting with that kick. Going out of the body with that hook. Well done there by Lee. Aldo's eye now closing up. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Not there. Nice knee to the body. How good is that right hand? Aldo gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. And again, Joe, he's showing a vulnerability to that jab, leaning right into his opponent's striking range and leaving his head wide open to absorb damage. Let's see if he can make some adjustments here. Nice body kick there. Jose Aldo with a nasty jab. Oh, very nice. Big body shot. shot. Body. Body kick, look at that. Aldo gets touched by that leg kick attempt. Nice kick there by Lee. Look at that, right to the temple. Well, he's always on the counter attack, but a nice leg kick there by Lee. Well, he's got a strong jab. Missed with it there, though, Joe. All right, less than three minutes remain in round four. Nice jab. Pretty good knee to the body by Lee. Push kick there to the body. Oh, nice work with the knee there by Lee. Nice slip to avoid that right hand. Just out of range with that punch attempt there, Joe. Oh, landed it. Oh, straight to the body by Alda. Good left hand. Now they're both throwing with power. There he swung with a haymaker. Lee gets caught with that punch. Again going back to the jab just out of range. Well, he left his body wide open there for that hook shot, Joe, and he paid for it. He is leaning in. I know he's got the guard high, but that means the body is exposed and the opposition took full advantage there. Axe kick. 
Oh, power kick to the arms. Straight right is there. Beautifully placed in time knee there by Lee. Aldo's lower jaw very swollen now. Time to bite down on the mouthpiece and move forward. Under a minute to go in round four. Misses a huge hook to the head. Plans an outside leg kick of his own. Oh, he got cracked. Slips that left hand. Some nice deception there as he lands the hook. He's doing a good job of throwing punches and kicks from all angles here. Really doing a great job of mixing things up. Slips the punch nicely there. Final seconds here. Lee gets caught by that straight punch. You gotta do better than that defensively. Tagged him again. And there's the buzzer indicating the end of round four. All right, so the round is over, and the fighter's eye is something that we're gonna keep an eye on, no pun intended here. It's starting to swell pretty badly. It hasn't swollen shut, but if it does, they'll bring the doctor in. That is a nasty, nasty swelling that he's dealing with here. And another perfectly placed strike. Some really well-placed strikes on display in that round. This is a very close fight. I want you to pick the pace up this round, and I want you... Ariane Celeste in the building as usual. Here we go, that's why we're ready. We're ready. Let's we go. have arrived at this fifth and final round. Strike there is blocked. Nice job by the defense. Misses with that punch. Nasty body kick by Aldo. Back to the well with that right hand. It's no good. Punch is blocked. Oh, nice jab by Aldo. That bruise on his torso is getting much worse. Aldo gets caught with that punch. That's again the experience. Effective punch there by Aldo. And he lands it to the leg. Well, he got his head snapped back by that straight hand there, and he's shown a vulnerability tonight by leaning right into that punch as he tries to set up his own offense. May want to focus on some defense here moving forward. Nice inside leg kick, very nice. Decent right hook attempt, but it's no good. And he continues to work on the inside of that lead leg. Good shot. Huge uppercut misses. He's really doing a good job of controlling distance and getting off these shots. Flush right hand is true. Nice job to get the foot off the canvas and to the target quickly. Beautiful inside leg kick by Alda. Oh, that's as good a jab as you'll see, Joe. Lee going for the head kick. No dice. Ooh, well-placed kick. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Good combination. Beautiful right hand. Nice spinning attack there, able to land to the body. Lee gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Look at that jab. Nice. Back to the jab now. No good. Wow. That one hurt. Lee's eye looks so swollen now, Joe, that I would at least ask the question, is that a fractured orbital bone? He very well might be dealing with it. Aldo gets touched by that kick to the body. Oh, that's a big block, Joe. Really swung for the fences with that hook, but misses. 
Pretty good jab there by Aldo. Oh, he left his head wide open to absorb that straight hand. He has shown a vulnerability here by leaning in right into his opponent's range. Under two minutes now to go in the fight. Head kick lands, Joe. How about these two going at it? Oh, landed that inside leg kick. Already a welt on his opponent. Just out of range with that strike. Very nice leg kick there by Aldo. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Nice head kick there. Oh, he just misses with the right hook there, Joe. Beautiful Superman punch. All right, less than a minute to go now in this fifth and final round. Slightly deflected. Some nice back and forth action here. Just missed with the huge kick. That bruise on his outer thigh is really getting nasty. Oh, effective strike there by Albert. Quick jab. Big left hook coming, it's blocked. Final seconds of the fight. Looking to land the right, just out of range. The final horn sounds! Well, certainly one of the better fights here tonight, and it lives to hear that final horn. Close fight, both fighters had their moments, and they were standing on a napkin at times in the center of that octagon. Both landing significant strikes, one after the next. Let's see who the judges saw as the rightful winner of this one. And round three, another great, accurate shot. And here we are in round four. We see another shot landing right on target. And in the final round, excellent timing again on that strike. All right, the official decision is now in. Here is Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest. 48-47. Declaring the winner by unanimous decision, Jose Aldo Jr. All right, so a massive victory for the former two-time UFC featherweight champion, Jose Aldo, here tonight. He's got a new facility at Nova Uniao there in Rio. Perhaps that paid some dividends here on fight night, but ultimately this is a guy, Joe, who has plus skill.